Hey and welcome back. In the previous lesson, we did some cleanup and applied some base CSS. So now let's focus on building out our login flow. So the first thing I want to do is close everything. Navigate to my uh, source folder and create a new folder called layouts. Within layouts, I want to create two more folders. The first one will be auth layout. And the next one will be profile layout. Now inside the auth layout, I want to create two new files. The first will be auth layout.js. And the second one will be auth layout.scss. I want to import my variables inside my components folders inside of variables folders and then the variables.scss semicolon next i want to apply some placeholder style so i will say auth layout background will be pink give that a quick save navigate back to my auth layout js file write my snippet and this component will be auth layout Inside, I want a div tag with a class name of auth layout. Inside that, a paragraph tag, and I will say auth layout. Next, I want to import the CSS file. So import auth layout CSS. Give it a quick save. Now, I also want to do the exact same thing to the profile layout folders. Create two new files profile layout.js and then profile layout.scss once again import my variables apply some placeholder style background will be pink give it a quick save go back to my profile layout JS name my component and once again a div tag with a profile layout class name inside that a paragraph tag and it will say profile layout import in my CSS file Give that a quick save and then close everything. I want to navigate to my app.js file. So before we move on, I want to open up my terminal and add a new package. And that is React Router DOM. Press enter and let that run. All right, cool, clear, and then close my terminal. I want to import a few things from that package. The first will be browser router as router and then switch and then route from react router dom i also want to import the two layouts that we just created the first being auth layout from my layout folders inside that folder and then this file the next will be my profile layout also for my layout folders that folder and then that file next i want to delete these lines wrap my router as the head followed by switch and then route this will be a closing tag i will define a path it will be the home path forward slash and i want it to be the exact path and the component i want it to render will be my auth layout give it a quick save and then check out my front end as you can see when we visit our home route it will render out the auth layout component all right let's go back to vs code so i want to break down what we are doing so the idea behind this login flow is that once we transition into building out our server there will be a piece of state called is logged in and if that is true we will render our profile layout and if it's false, we will render out our auth layout. 
So obviously our server is not fully set up yet. So I would define the state here in the meantime. I will say const is logged in and set that equal to false. So in my route tag, instead of rendering out this auth layout component, I'm going to delete this and write a ternary operator. So I want to say if is logged in is true, render out my profile layout. And if it's false, I want to render out the auth layout. Give that a quick save and check out my front end. As you can see, the auth layout is still rendered because the is logged in state is false. And if I change this from false to true, give that a quick save and check out my front end. As you can see, the profile layout will be the one that's rendered. Go back to my VS code and I want to get rid of this line. We no longer need the login component here. So this wrap up our lesson. In our next lesson, we will focus on our auth layout component. All right, see you then.